What's up guys? Welcome to Mike It Yourself. Today is Review Wednesday. And for today's video, we're gonna cover the saddlebag extensions I put on my uh, 2017 Road Glide. So I've had them on for a little bit, and you know, as usual, I like to kind of revisit things that I've done to provide you all feedback with whether or not, you know, it worked out in the longer run, right? Like, cause you know, as soon as you put something on, of course you just bought it. You feel good about your purchase and immediately, traditionally you feel like hey it was the right move right and then after that honeymoon phase then you kind of get into that like and eh, maybe this wasn't such a great idea in this particular case still a good idea so you know looking at where this thing seems because it's like a cap you know i don't have a bunch of grime or crud or anything growing in there or whatever you know so that still really looks clean the paint is holding up very well and uh, as I look on the inside, um, you know, one of the things that I said I was going to do was replace the screws that come through the bottom. And I did that with some shorter ones. So that way the uh, actual bolt didn't kind of protrude through too much. So that way I didn't have to worry about like if I put something like a plastic bag or whatever in here, it doesn't tear up the bag or get hooked up on it or whatever. So that's a huge plus. And if, if you notice, I'm like, I'm the guy who, who you want to pull over when you're on the side of the road pulled over. I've, I've got like all my tools and stuff. Basically, I, I don't like to be stranded anywhere and helpless. That's just my thing, right? Um, but overall, like I said, it looks amazing still. I, I love the, the color match of it. So these are the velvet black ones and yeah, they look great. So, I'm super happy about these. I'm glad they've withstood the test of time. I'm really surprised that a lot of folks didn't realize that you could actually buy these little extensions versus getting the stretch bags. Now, I know the stretch bag does give you a little bit more room capacity in your saddlebag where this doesn't do that for you. Um, this is cosmetic, right? Like, it's just for the look. And uh, with my air uh, ride system on it, when I drop it and those extensions are on, it just, bing, right? Like... Can't get any better. I love it. So I hope you enjoyed this. Again, a good win. If you're on the fence about whether or not you should buy these and it's just because you're not sure how they're going to you know, last over time, I'd say don't hold back any further. Definitely uh, purchase these. I think in the original video, I may have added in the Amazon link to the ones that I bought. But if you just, you know, Google it or whatever, they'll pull them all up. Just make sure you get the right ones for your bike because the saddlebags between the newer bikes and the older bikes are a little bit different. There's like a little kind of um, indentation that runs along the, the, the saddlebag and kind of goes down to the bottom. So it bows out just a little bit on the older bag. So if you get the wrong caps, you're gonna have a big old gap on the side there and you're not gonna be happy. So just make sure you pay attention to that when you buy yours. But other than that, like I said, an absolute win. Hope you enjoyed this. If you did, hit that thumbs up. If you enjoy my content, subscribe. And uh, if you don't want to miss out on that next video, hit the notification bell. You'll get the buzz buzz uh, when the next video posts. And until then, I hope to see you in the win.